Well, you guessed it, we're back at Terminal 21. So first we have to go up for these and head to food court level on level five. So the first big stairs brings you to level three, Istanbul. Let's have a look. And then you need to go to San Francisco. Yeah, it's right there, level four. And when you get to level four, San Francisco, just continue straight. Here it says, departure for level five, San Francisco Pier 21. Okay, level five. So let's turn left, continue this road right here. And we're gonna come to the yummy food court. Just in, a, in less than one minute, actually. So let's see. They go past a lot of Japanese stores, uh, restaurant, sorry, not stores, but you can call it whatever you want. If you can buy something, it's kind of a store. If you can buy food, yeah, restaurant, but still. So, um, to be able to buy your food at Pier 21 Food Court here in Terminal 21, you need to get a cask cash card so you can either stand here in line now the line is really short or you can go to the other side let me show you so you have you just have to go straight here here you have a no, it's a bit <laughs> takes a long time they walk very, very slowly Uh, and I think I walk like a normal pace. Yeah. So then you turn left. Here it says 22 up there. And here you have the second one. So let's go to the Patai's place, okay? Yes. It's right here. Turn right here. And here you find the Patai place at number five so enjoy your pad thai here so this pad thai it was 52 baht with these shrimps or prawns and uh, a big difference between the other one i ate with almost 400 baht so i want to see if this is good or if this is bad and also if you want without shrimps they only cost 30 baht here it's really cheap. So let's tr start to try these prawns. Let's see. They're not as big as the other type. And no, the prawns are pretty much tasteless. So hardly any flavor at all. Yeah, tasteless. Like plain, yeah, plain, not, I cannot even feel like any shrimp taste actually. No. Okay, let's check the patai. First, they gave me some uh, Kung Hang uh, dry shrimps. I don't like them actually, so I'm not gonna eat them. Uh, I got a lot of these. So I'm going to remove the kung hang, the dried shrimps. Um, and then, let's see how this tastes without any extra things on. I'm going to try this if this are uh, the tofu, let's see. Dry. Okay, let's see how this tastes now. I actually feel the flavor of shrimp. I don't know if it's shrimp paste or what actually. Because I feel shrimp paste, shrimp flavor in the pad thai. So now I'm gonna put some lime. And unless you're allergic, I'm gonna put on the peanuts, making more peanutty flavor. Mmm. Okay, now, let's see how the flavor is. 
So this one it was 52 bucks. If I compare it, this is plain. It's really no, not that much taste actually. Hmm. Hard to say, but I actually think that the but the other one was better. More expensive, yes, but better. But then it's a money issue. Do you want to pay 400 baht for pad thai or do you want to pay 52 baht for pad thai? Oh, now they're talking about me removing this one. So I'm gonna put it here. I'll see. So remove the little Hua Hong, uh, his cranky Chinese guy. And with this 52, I had a mango smoothie. And this one was 30 baht. Mm. Yummy. My daughter, who sits right in front of me and already eaten, she had a watermelon smoothie. That was 25 baht. They're finally released out of China. And they're eating a lot of food. Chinese tourists, that is. Now, let's have a big one. Mm. I don't think I should say it's bad. But it's a plain taste. It doesn't taste like the other one. It was more flavor. Like, you can feel was like, well done. But this place doesn't have any Michelin guide or anything. But still, plain. There's one more place I want to try. I saw it on, what was his name? Gary Butler. It was like a Pad Thai cowboy or something. It's somewhere around, I can't see on. I think it's Southern. So I'm gonna go there and I'm gonna have a Pad Thai as well. Some more peanuts. Well, oh, I have to eat these shives. No, it's not shives. Is it shives? No, it's shives. No. This is something else, but yeah. It's not shives. Yeah. Okay, so my final verdict. Is it worth 52 baht? Yes and no. Will the pad thai that costs 30 baht be worth 30 baht? Of course. But these shrimps, tasteless. Uh, not yummy. So if you're vegetarian, I would go with uh, 30 baht. This one, nah. But still, okay to eat. Now my daughter wants some ice cream. So until next time, bye bye.